Good evening, everyone. This is Night Prayer from Abington Church in Tamworth. My name is Sue Joyce, and I'm recording this at home. Today is Thursday, the 3rd of December. As we begin, let us sit quietly and comfortably and set aside the things of the day and focus on God. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Cast your cares on the Lord, and he will sustain you. Let us now sit for a few more moments in silence and reflect on the day that's gone Bring to mind all the things that we've said and done and thought, whether for good or ill, and bring to mind too all those people that we've met or encountered. And as well, just take a few moments to rest in God's presence. Having reflected on the day, there may be some things we need to say sorry to God for. So we say our confession together. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Our reading for today, Thursday, comes from 1 Peter chapter 5. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, is prowling round like a roaring lion, seeking for someone to devour. Resist him, strong in the faith. We say together the Nunc Dimittis. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Now there's a time for a longer period of prayer. You can use this as you wish, or you can use these prompts. You can thank God for his presence and his patience with you throughout the day. You can share with God every detail of a situation if there's anyone or anything troubling you. And two, we can ask him to help us to trust him and to release us from the burden of anxiety.
Our collect for today, Thursday. Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you for all the benefits that you have won for us, for all the pains and insults that you have borne for us. Most merciful Redeemer, friend and brother, may we know you more clearly, love you more dearly, and follow you more nearly, day by day. Amen. From our prayer calendar today, we pray for Rose Swaddle, Linda Dern, and Simon Dern. And we pray too for the groups responsible for evangelism and outreach, but remembering too that that's the responsibility of every one of us. So may all these people, Lord, know your blessing, your presence, and your peace this night. And our church family prayer, this is our prayer. Come, Holy Spirit, and make us one in heart and action, so that we can serve God faithfully, abounding in love, maturing in holiness, and seeking out the lost. Help us grow as disciples of Jesus in commitment, in depth, and in number, that we may be a blessing to Amington, to the glory and praise of God the Father. Amen. We say together our night collect. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace. And may your blessing be always upon us through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray with confidence as our Saviour has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, for thine is the kingdom the power and the glory for ever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep, for you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen.